Hey, this is Mirgloth Builds, and in today's video I'm going to be building a Sand Nation Cree Post uh, a little bit distance away from the uh, cap sand capital of Thelonia. And this is going to be as a monument to one of my subscribers, Skyrim Legend Games. And uh, at the Towards the end of the video, I will uh, talk about off-camera work that I've done, but we're going to begin building now.
Okay, so the Monument to Skyrim Legends games is complete. And it is the West Creep Post of uh, Thelonia. We'll take a look at the exterior while, while I explain, explain what a Creep Post is. A uh, Creep Post is a Russian, actu actually is a Russian uh, term for a fortified settlement. Usually... Uh, an actual Russian creep post would be more like the size of a small town. But for this case, it's just a small settlement, more like a fort. Now, in the terms of what uh, the creep post is for in regards to the Sand Nation, is despite... Uh, exclusively settling in uh, building their towns and cities inside of uh, it's too loud for me inside of deserts they do need to defend their territory and the surrounding area and these creep posts serve as a uh, way to keep watch over the surrounding uh, territory We'll take a look at the, the buildings here. Now, the, this, the architecture uh, uses a lot of stone in place of uh, where sand would be because, because this is not a desert, the rainfall would cause the sand to erode. Not realistically in terms of Minecraft physics, but just in general physics and sense and scent ah I'm having trouble saying that word just physics in general as far as architecture and it doesn't really obviously it doesn't really blend so well but in this case I think it I think it's okay and this is the uh, one of the barracks which also below has a storage room and also some crafting. And I just left a few miscellaneous things that I don't want to take back with me. Except I will be taking these materials back to Thelonia with me. <clears throat> Though I would like to place... Some of these apples that I got from clearing out the trees in this area. In some of these chests. And I have been uh, playing in creative mode. Building in creative mode uh, more, or not creative mode, uh, peaceful. Peaceful difficulty settling uh, more often. Because uh, I don't have a good food situation set up. I need to build a wheat farm. I've been kind of not doing that. And up here is the uh, creep post tower, the watch tower. Where, the, where a guard would be posted to watch the surrounding area. See if any unwanted or hostile troops, mobs, or uh, spies or traveling in the region and there's just a little farm here I'm probably not going to really take the time to let it grow and plant it all properly but its purpose is served for the aesthetic as opposed to the practicality and now I'm gonna head back to the uh, Thelonia over there and I'll explain some of the uh, off-camera work that I've done. Okay, so we're back at Thelonia. Now the majority of the off-camera work that I've uh, spent my time doing has been uh, trying to clear this area out. And I'll continue to do so. And then I did some uh, stuff with the sheep over here, collected some wool, and uh, made more pens, or made another pen, rather. 
And I have uh, green and yellow sheep uh, producing wool now. And I, have, I didn't really do too much off-camera work uh, during the, the regular week. I tried to make uh, some videos during my work week, but time got the better of me. And this is a sheep here. They're very loud. And that's pretty much it for off-camera work. As I said, time got the better of me this week. But I do have some vacation time coming up from work, so plenty of time to make videos and do some off-camera work that I've uh, been putting off, such as uh, building more apartments apartment blocks and they'll be I won't be uh, making videos of that but uh, they will look uh, the same as these over here apartment block A and B what I'm gonna do is build A on that side and B on that side you know at least architecturally the same style of building and I'll do that off camera and I'll probably do some uh, work on the sewer system as well, just sort of digging out the channels as seen here. Dig them deeper and uh, extend them further. And thanks for watching. There will be more videos later. See you later.